Okay, so we're back. Um, where we last left our very, very crazy heroes. Uh, I would like to call up heroes, yes. Um, we smashed a few of the gravestones. We probably are nearing the boss battle for this floor, so there's a small note. Let me help you. Dots, dot, dots. Hey, you find something? It's nothing. Right. Let's, let's move on. It's another note. If you want to suffer, I'll make it painful. If you want to go without pain, I'll be gentle, whichever way you prefer. Dot dot dot. More dots. This is a small note. Hey, how do you want to die? What do you keep stopping for? It says, I'll gladly kill you. Dot dot dot. Something's floating in the water. Uh, is that what I think it is? Oh, that? What are we gonna do about it? I'm not sure, but I want you to go in there and stand in the submerged hollow area. In the water, you want me to do what? If you're gonna cry about it, then. Yeah, pissy baby. Yeah, I didn't say I wasn't gonna do it. Unlike you, there's no way in hell I'd die in a place like this. You've been silent as shit this whole time. Uh, anyways, don't get any crazy ideas about dying or being killed. I'm not gonna be stuck here any longer than I gotta be. Uh, are you really gonna kill me? I'm such... I'm such a nobody. Hmm, dot dot dots. If you wanna die so bad, then why not just kill yourself? Because it's unforgivable. Huh? Why is that? Because it's will of the gods? Hell if I know. Well, even I'm not entirely sure. But if it's the word of the god, then it must be absolute. It's unforgivable. Oh, god says so, huh? In any case, you gotta prove your worth to me before I can kill you. <laughs> okay. What do you want? Make yourself useful. Also, if I'm gonna kill you you can try to make it worth my while maybe show anger or uh, cry for your life show anger or cry for my life dot 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 you know facial muscles to show emotion um sure you're not already dead hmm uh, i'm alive so i want you to kill me Ah, uh, fine, fine. Hey, can you give me a smile? Smile. Dot dot dot. Dot. Hmm. Hmm? How's that? You're dead in the eyes. Yeah, that's no good. Uh, what are we wasting time on this crap for? Hey, so I just need to stand on top of that thing over there. Don't die. Well, hurry and get over there already. It's cold and gross over here. No, okay. Yeah, I think we have to press the other switch. I gotta go back to the place earlier with a hollow spot and stand on top of it. Yup. Let's not waste any time. Also, I hope I don't get mugged by that lady. And there's a small note. Don't be startled, you know why? Because we are one and the same in our desires. Dot dot dot. It's dark. I gotta turn on a light. This small note again. I shall grant what you desire, but I've got my own desires as well. Dot dot dot. Sorry. I only belong to that Zack guy who wants to kill me now. If possible, I want you to devote yourself to me. I mean, 
isn't it great being in love? Sorry, I already like that Zack guy who is gonna slash me in half, really. Small note. I know all about you. You wanna die, right? Right, so just say yes. Doors unlocked. Dot dot dot. Shit, how long do I gotta stay in the water for? Hey, it feels like something rang under my feet. That means I can move now, right? I think you better save your friend who's probably gonna... You know, get in trouble. Wonder how she's doing. Guess I'll head back to the hole she went in. Huh? Oh, what the? Looks like some dumbass forgot to pay the electric bill. Damn rat trap of a place. She's still not back. What the hell's inside there anyway? If that bitch bolts on me, nah, that won't happen. What the hell's is up with her anyway? Won't run, and all emotionless. Yeah, killing her would be boring as fuck. Dot dot dot. Hmm. Apart from the dead-eyed stare, she almost looked alive back there. Uh, I'm about to go out of my mind. Not again. Oh, are you freaking serious? It's pitch black. Who's there? Your grave desecrator. Oh, you grave desecrator. Huh? Howdy, Zach. How's Crisis Core? Okay, Edward Mason, aka Eddie. I had a nice spot for you with everyone else, but you ruined your own grave. You're insane. That may be, but don't you think mine was a piss poor excuse for a grave? No. Damn you. Sorry, due to circumstances, yours was a bit of a rush job. The hole's only half dug. But your tombstone's just fine. It fits you to a T if you catch my drift. <laughs> How about I make your grave first? Well, enough about you. I'm more interested in getting that girl's grave finished. I'm... I'm in love. It's always the same thing, making graves for murder victims day in and day out. I was getting a touch bored. Sure, making graves is my passion, but the bodies that occupy them are not quite as lovable. Beauty is what they lack. But for that girl, I want nothing more than to make the grave of my dreams for her. I think we're around the same age too. Most of all, I want to show her I understand her. We're made for each other. That should be infinitely more beautiful than some sloppy and mangled corpse. Oh, should she desire it? S it. Salape is perfectly fine too. Now, are you trying to make me hurl? What? My sophistication makes me the perfect match for her. Too bad I can't say the same for you. That's why the one taking her life will be me. Sounds like some little punk doesn't know his place. Shit, I can't see my hand in front of my face. Punk. Damn him. Hey, get your ass back here, you little squirt that could go inside that hole. Uh, it's cold. Gaps. It won't open. Dot dot dot. I guess something's wrong with the torch. Uh oh. Uh-oh, you're in trouble. There it goes again. Oh, that's creepy. Is it running low on juice? 
Beats me. Hey, Rachel, I'll grant your desire. What was that? Hmm, what was that indeed? An icy chill pervades the air. It appears to be a freezer. Something's written on it. Only for my use. The temperature and heat are displayed. Some sort of device. Some sort of fan. Hey. It's filled with cold water. The water smells like some sort of chemical. So, what do you want me to do here? Shall I just go back? Temperature control device. It has a bar for adjusting the water temperature. Yeah. Oh, something's written on it. Oh, wait. I already read that. Okay. Oh, what the? There's a thermostat displaying the water temperature. The temperature is quite low. Now I feel a tad guilty for making Zack get in the water. I'll raise the water temperature. Mm hmm? If I raise this... Rachel, no! Huh? The lights. Don't act so surprised. The one talking to you this whole time is none other than me. Dot dot dot. There's no need to run. I won't fly off the handle and kill you like the others. Besides, I know what you desire. Dot dot dot. My desire. Yes, that's right. No worries, I know everything about you. You're... Father and mother, those close to you, everything. If it were me, I'd take your life as painlessly as possible, and even make the perfect grave for you. Plus, just look at me. You and I are even around the same age, we're practically made for e each other. I don't think I would like to date a scarecrow if I had a choice. I... What are you so silent for? Please, Rachel. Say no, say no, say no. Please say yes. Say no. You really want to be around crows and scarecrows forever? Hey, get back out here. I said get your ass back out here now. Shit. Can she not hear me? Oh, freaking fudge. Did she go in? Ugh. That grave digging dipshit thinking he can outwit me. That punk. He's in love with her and wants to kill him herself. Her him himself. Thought makes me want to puke. I can't have her go dying on me yet. Hmm, she mentioned something about another room in the back of the on the right. Wasn't there a crumbling wall in the room on the right side? Guess I'll take a look. Yeah, you go, Zach. Go save your beloved that you want to kill. Ugh. It's a crack in the wall. Hmm. It's, uh, not here. <laughs> oh, there it is. Hey, can you hear me? Are you there? Rachel, what's troubling you? Go on, tell me your desire. Dot dot dot. I wanna die. Uh, look, I told you so. Uh, Rachel, let me put out of- put you out of your misery. So, oh, you say yes. Dot, dot, dot. But, but, I'm attached. Someone already wants to kill me. I'm getting impatient. C could it be his doing? Dot, dot, dot. Tell me, why are you with Zack? I promised to let him kill me. What? Wow, that's so messed up. I even offered to kill you myself, too. But if I let you, then he won't be able to get out of here. Uh, is that all? That shouldn't be a problem at all. Hey, can you hear me? Are you there? Hmm. Uh, looks like loud mouse here. Choose who will be your killer, him or me? 
My sweet Rachel, let me lovingly put you to rest. Better run. Sophisticated, more like medicated. You're gonna, you're gonna kill her with that boring look on her face? What a fucking idiot. No, will you shut up? Rachel and I are talking. Hey, can you hear me? I'm not talking to the grave digging dipshit. I'm talking to you. Me? Yes, you. Listen up. Don't think for one second that you can die of your own will. There's plenty of people in this building who'd love to kill you. But I'll have the honor. I swear to God. Whoa, 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 what's with this dubstep music? <gasps> to God? Uh-huh. So she's devoted to God, but she wants to die? <laughs> Doesn't make any sense, that's for sure. So make sure nobody else gets to you first. Dot dot dot. Hmm. I'm sorry, Mr. Scarecrow, but I got a date with destiny. Which is kind of like death with another person. Rachel? Hit that wall as hard as you can. Ray. Oh, that was it? I thought she, he was gonna do some heroic shit like beat the crap out of that scarecrow guy. Oh well. Chow Chow, what's up, my homie? Where'd that fucking punk go? Why, Rachel? Is it so wrong for me wanting to kill you? Of course it's wrong, you fucking moron. My, you are so vicious, Rachel. I mean, you are so vicious. Rachel, Rachel, do you want me him to kill you? He'll definitely bungle it up. Why not let me instead? I'll do a pristine job. Pristine job. Pristine, whatever. Shut the fuck up. Show yourself so I can tear you apart. Rachel, you are mine to kill. Yeah, whatever. I'm just gonna go to the next floor now. Bye, you crazy motherfucker. Can you wait for me till then? Damn, that bastard bolted on me. You're just as much of a spineless wimp yourself. You'll be dead before I even have a chance to kill you. Dot dot dot. Yeah. Huh? Like I said before, if you're gonna die, then at least make yourself useful first. If I do, then you'll kill me, right? That's what I've been saying. What you said earlier. God, you said God. Yeah, to God. You said that you swear to God. I'm basically a nun now. I'm so religious. I love you. It's what you said true. You swear to God for me. You swear to God you'll kill me? You'll kill me. For God's sake, yes. Now quit pestering me. I hate liars. Hmm. Guess these guys have something in common. I see. Gotcha. I'll do everything I can to make myself useful to you by not dying and then dying on later. <laughs> ah, this game. <laughs> yeah, then we're good. So what's the plan now? I heard the sound of a door open earlier. I think it might be the door below here. That kid is waiting, or so he said. So do I just... Yeah, okay. Progress. The power room. Funny enough, it still smells like dirt here. But what in the hell, more graves? Hey, don't get any ideas about going into any more holes. I said I wouldn't kill myself. <laughs> I suppose you did. Anyway, I've got no intention of sticking around this dirt dub. Let's get the hell out of here. Oh, uh, wait. 
Wait for me, buddy. I'm coming. Hey, what's your name again? Um, Rachel Gardner. Oh, I'm taking you along for my own personal gain. But man, it's a pain in the ass having you around, right, Ray? Hello, we meet again. Out of my way, fucking brat. What makes you think I gotta do what you say? Hey, Rachel, are you sure you don't want me to do it? Do you even know anything about who this guy is? He has no passion for grace and a slovenly pass. I read about his pass on a document earlier. And what's the problem? Why choose him over me? I can kill you too, you know. He swore to God that he'd kill me. That alone is everything to me. Who's this high and mighty God? That's crazy. This so-called God of yours never told me any of this. Any of this. No such freedom exists in this place. The only freedom we're given is for our actions on our own floors. And the right to kill. Hmm. You are not the one who will kill me. You hear that? How you like that, fucking brat? Oh, how dreadful. I just wanted to bury you, preserving your beauty. Don't you know, graves are dark, cool and comfy. At the very least, let me take you there. <coughs> oh god. Blech. No, you worthless hellion. Shut up, it's not like you're any different from me, just another murderer. Speak for yourself. For all your physical strength, you still haven't been able to catch anyone with that empty head of yours. Unable to kill anyone, you're just a useless angry mess. That's rich coming from you. You're the one who's desperate. Just a frustrate, frustrated little dipshit who couldn't kill a fly is all you are. Psht! Give me a fucking break. Shut your trap, you idiot. As far as I'm concerned, you don't exist. I'm after Rachel, not you. <laughs> Floor B4, Eddie. Rachel, I'll seal you eternally in a lovely casket of stone. Uh, damn it, not again. Where the hell are you? You're like a turd that won't flush. I must kill Rachel. Why does everybody want to kill me? Jeez, Louise. Ugh, watch out. This game has no continues. Rachel, go on ahead without me. Hmm. You said something about power room, right? It should be somewhere around here. Go turn on. Turn it on. Okay. Wait, Rachel. Okay, apparently I'm saving. That means... I'm probably gonna die. The batteries are almost dead. I gotta hurry. Turn on the goddamn light! There's a deep, deep hole in the ground. Where are you, Rachel? Shit! Fuck! Stop, 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 just... Damn it! Damn it! Is it... Is the power room? Ah, so that's where you are. Okay, I think this is the power room. Okay. Here's the power. Phew! Thought I was gonna die. Why, Rachel? Why, I even made a grave for you and everything. Dot dot dot. Can you take a hint? She dumped your ass. <laughs> She's with me now, buddy. Ray doesn't want your petty grave. Get away, traitor. Grave desecrator, fiend. Rachel, lose this fin fiendish ruffian and hop into my grave. What do you say? Hey, if you're so obsessed with graves, then how about I bury you first? <laughs> I got the perfect one picked out for you. Oh, I almost forgot. I'll see it lit up tight just like you said. Okay. You kind of... You kicked over the gravestone. Wow. <laughs> To seal up the hole? Nice. Nice job, Zach. Proud of you. And that's that. Yes, yeah, so... Hey, not bad for a punk kid. 
the dipshit sex fate under just like he wanted. Fucking smart ass grave digging bastard. Uh, something's on the back of this grave. Yeah? There's a switch that says elevator gate. Hmm. It's probably the elevator switch. Ooh, push it. Okay. Now we should be able to go up. Nice. Alright. Well, goodbye, creepy guy who wants to bury me and kill me. Uh, at last, I can say goodbye to this dirt reeking dump. This is B4, so there's probably still more flows above. Uh, when will it end? Um, hmm? Did I make myself useful to you, sir? Sir? Dot dot dot. Uh, can you quit calling me sir? Makes me edgy. You're already edgy. How about Isaac? Zach, just call me Zach. Uh, okay. Was I of any use to you, Zach? Just a tiny bit. Uh, oh. Oh, that's adorable. Oh no, he's gonna kill you now. Dot dot dot. Don't smile too much. If you enjoy this moment too much, he's probably gonna stab you. Let's get going. Okay. Okay, so, um... This is episode 1 uh, for Angels of Death. There are 4 episodes to this game and I'll be playing all of them so don't worry. So this is just the credits for episode 1. Actually, I, I'm not sure why did they have to split it into 4 episodes. What were they trying to do like um, copy The Walking Dead or something or tell any type of telltale games? Hey, uh, dubstep. This is probably copyrighted. I hope not. But yeah, dubstep. Fucking great. I, I I love dubstep. That's like rupturing my ears right now because I had it on like high volume all the time. <clears throat> yeah. So the game not done, but um, I, I I I'm not sure what credits are for because. We're only like one quarter yet to be continued. We're only like one quarter done. But the artwork, uh, it's nice. The game's nice. Horror, all that jazz. And, yep. Don't worry. I'll be uploading episode 2 real soon, so... Because I'm gonna be playing, like, immediately after this. So, yep. Uh, so thanks everyone for watching Angels of Death episode 1 and I'll see you guys in episode 2. Yeah, so stay frosty y'all.